This is an overview of the Trans-New Hampshire Expedition, or TNHX. This video will focus on the guided version, but there are self-guided options available through Exploring NH as well. The trip begins in the quiet and beautiful town of Pittsburgh, in the northernmost part of the state, right on the Canadian border. After meeting everyone, in a quick, informative driver's meeting, the group heads south, zigzagging through the north woods, along old logging roads and seasonal roads, stopping for a few optional hikes and lunch alongside a waterfall. After lunch, we continue south into the White Mountain National Forest to one of the highlights of the trip, the Mount Washington Auto Road. We gather at the foot of the mountain. An auto road official gives us some tips and our convoy heads up to the summit together. Of course, everyone hopes for a clear day, but it really doesn't matter. The road, the weather, the whole experience is worth the trek. After a safe and slow descent, we pass through North Conway to a campground. There will be a block of sites that we will share with plenty of room for everyone to set up camp. On Saturday, we head southwest towards Newport. Today starts off on pavement, beginning with the Kankamangas Scenic Byway, or the Kank. We travel nearly its entire length, stopping occasionally for breaks and to take in the views. This road can be quite busy at times, but our group leaders do their best to keep us all together. After stopping for lunch and airing our tires down, the group leaves the pavement in favor of unmaintained Class 6 roads. The off-pavement travel is more difficult than the logging roads yesterday and can vary quite a bit depending on the recent weather. After a few more Class 6 roads, some of the group is eager to get to camp and set up and others decide to take on more difficult Class 6 roads. The group rejoins at camp, and we all spend some time together around the campfire. On the first part of Sunday, the group sees very little pavement. The trails start off easy, but quickly become more rocky. Our trail leader guides everyone through the tricky spots. Like three feet and then start turning up with me. Right there, now start turning up. Nice and slow. Slow. You should clear, so nice and slow. Nice, 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 slow. Be good, nice. After a short scenic drive, we stop for lunch alongside a river. After lunch, we air up our tires and head to the seacoast. Here at the seacoast, our adventure comes to an end with close access to Route 101 and I-95, as well as many local restaurants. It's hard to believe how different one end of New Hampshire is from the other.